we actually make use of the GCP account in order to get the Google API which is a cloud vision API we make use of so that um, this is a video showing how we obtained the key from the Google API uh, I mean GCP account we initially enabled the API in the project we make use of a cloud vision API so We just enabled the Cloud Vision API. This is already enabled. And then we move to the settings. We move to the credentials in order to access the enabled API and we create credential and we need a service account so that from there we can obtain the api information as a json file that is the key information as a json file so we need to input the service name And we need to create the key. The key, the key we create here will be enabled to perform the cloud vision functions too, as we have enabled the cloud vision. So we need the key in the form of a JSON file. So we press create. And the key is downloaded. And actually, we make use of this key in our program. We have explained it in the video that uh, we pick this we store this key in a particular location and then we obtain the location or path of the particular key and we will input it in our program so that our program will work according to, accordingly to get the output of the handwritten images.